29 year old Maluba Habanyama was two years old when she was diagnosed with HIV. Now she's dedicated to smashing the stigma surrounding the virus. My story starts back in 1993 when I was born to two Zambian parents uh, and my older sister. I was born in London, England. Um, and when my mother and father separated, my mother brought me, myself, and my sister to Canada. And in Canada, when I was getting very, very sick at the age of two years old in 1995, um, unfortunately, it was discovered that I was born with HIV. Uh, my mother is living with HIV and my father was living with HIV. We moved all around Canada, unfortunately, because my mother would tell one person at a church and then the next day, the whole congregation knew. So there's so much stigma and so much shame. For years, Maluba kept her diagnosis a secret for fear of how people would perceive her. And we really have to dismantle the stigma because as much as we have all these advancements, there is still that negative comment, that person that is just perpetuating stigma and it's very dangerous. In 2017, Casey's House of Toronto based specialty hospital for those living with and at risk of HIV found 53% of Canadians would not knowingly eat food prepared by a person with HIV. This inspired the creation of June's HIV positive eatery and the hashtag smash stigma campaign. So June's HIV the eatery is a pop-up restaurant for three days where all of the chefs are living with HIV and all of the chefs have been professionally trained by Matt Basili, a famous Canadian chef and some other professional chefs. Malumba says that she's been involved with the event from the start and although she has cooked in the past this year she will be emceeing. The event is happening from June 14th to the 16th. To find out more information, you can go to our website, citynews.ca, under extras. For City News, I'm Stella Cuisto.